This next design I call Little Wings. It's a nice little butterfly for more mature young ladies. I like using to poke because that has good contrast. So we're gonna make kind of a wing on the outside first. And then we're gonna come in and finish it off. And don't worry about these little parts right here in the middle because we're gonna cover them up with the rest of our design. And then this is why I like using the angled shaders. So we can come in and make some nice flare and not have to reload another brush. Okay? So this could be a stopping place, less than a minute. Okay, but I'm going to go ahead and get a number three round brush, or a smallish one, like a number two. Whatever you like. And I'm going to load black up. So I'm going to do a longer teardrop. And then a few little teardrops like this. Same up here. And same here. Just like you would finish off a butterfly. And then if you want you can add a few dots to fill in those rough corner rough little edges there. Okay, and you can stop here. About a minute and a half. But we're going to go for some drama. I like asking them if they mind if I line their eyes. And so I'll line their eyes and join it in with the butterfly. It really adds some dramatic flair to it. And then just whatever your favorite swirl and curl is. A few teardrops. Maybe some flare coming out. And then I'll even make stars like in black while I've got it loaded. Okay, there's another good stopping place. And then just to add the little extra touch, I'll grab a contrasting color. So since I've got blue, I'll go into my warm colors. And I'll add a few little dots. And this is just as if I've got time because you can see it's adding some time to the clock. And there's a good stopping place. So a 3 minute and 22 second dramatic butterfly 